Just came back from Costa Rica and had such a blast. I wanted to go over and show you guys my trip. On the first day, we went to the Poas Volcano. It really is that blue color. It's so beautiful. Our first stop is the crater, the Poaz, ultra blue color. Then we decided to hike to the lagoon that was on top. It was honestly so humid when I got to Costa Rica. I totally forgot how humid a tropical place could be, but glad to be out and outdoors hiking in and see how beautiful this lagoon is. Afterwards, I got kind of hungry, so I ate some strawberry frescas. Sorry, it's half eaten. And then got an empanada, starving once I got there. Then, you know, saw some cows on the road, got to take a photo. Tons of dogs everywhere. This hi. dog just kind of approached my car to say hi. Hello, doggy. Then we passed some beautiful waterfalls just off the side of the highway as we were driving. So I had to stop and look how beautiful this rainforest is. Oh, I just had to get a snap of this view. Next, we went to the Carrera del Toro. Oh my god, I feel like I'm an avatar or something. Wow. So Amanda and I drove two hours on freaking potholes. Didn't we almost going. didn't make it. <laughs> but the view is definitely worth it. Holy balls. Oh, is this even cold? <laughs> We then hiked down to get a closer view of the waterfall. It was so amazing. That's so crazy! The hike back up though, a little less amazing. There was definitely a ton of stairs and I was so sweaty and humid. The next day I went to the Hanging Gardens in La Fortuna. Um, these are some kawadis. They look a little bit like raccoons but they have longer noses. Super cute! so cool exploring the rainforest and being in these hanging gardens. You can see these ants carrying all these leaves. It looks straight out of a textbook. In Panama? And here's the arena volcano. It's so cool. I really felt like it was a Jurassic Park. A little pineapple smoothie break. And here is a view of my Airbnb. I love this Airbnb. It's one of my favorite ones on this trip. You can see the volcano on the back. And here's like on the walkthrough. Here's a little hot tub. This is the rainforest in the back, and then we kind of go in, and here's our bed. Oh, so cute. Huge windows where you can see the volcano outside. And this is our bathroom. Like, oh, dinner time. Good evening. We have a frog in our freaking hot tub. But this was such a nice vibe to kind of come back to. Um, the next morning, we went to see the uh, like La Fortuna waterfall. Ugh, it's so pretty again. It was raining kind of slightly, but oh my god, like swimming in this waterfall. That water was powerful. 
Definitely feel a little dangerous coming in, but you know, I had to do it. So I had to check out the nearby like area around the waterfall. Um, such a beautiful blue. I wanted to swim in it a little bit. Uh, the water was warm and it was raining out. This was such a magical time. I love this so much. We decided to go to the Tabaka Hot Springs. This was like the best hot springs I've ever been to. It's a full on resort, um, and oh, I felt so relaxed. There are so many different pools to go into. Um, the view is amazing, and I don't know, I. Like, could rave more and more about it, but I feel like this is a must do if you ever go to Costa Rica. Here's some monkey, so you know, lots to see just eating at the hot springs. Decided to chill in the hot tub one more time before we left the next morning. We're out here in the cloud forest of Monte Verde. <laughs> Here's our view from our other Airbnb in Monte Verde. Also such a beautiful view. Cow crossing. The next morning went to a cow crossing. <laughs> Super funny. Um, but yeah, we had to go around them. Uh, I would say, you know, there's a lot of things that you get to go around on these roads of Costa Rica. A lot of potholes, a lot of wild animals, other cars, the usual. We crossed over the crocodile bridge. You can see these large crocodiles. And then my favorite part of the trip. Oh my gosh, these waterfalls were amazing. These are the Nanuka waterfalls. And oh my gosh, it blew me away. Number one spot I saw in Costa Rica, my favorite place ever. Next morning we went to Mount Antonio and saw a bunch of wild animals. That was a frog in the last shot. Here's the beautiful beaches. There is a little sloth up in that tree. You can see it moving. It was moving quite actively. I was pretty amazed by that. <coughs> there were a bunch of monkeys just running around. Um, there were so many animals here. I had a great time kind of spotting each one. such a super fun trip I uh, can't wait to come back I had a blast and if you ever need any more recs let me know <laughs> <laughs>